Christian used to be an avid footballer. Now this 25-year-old Russian sports fan has found a more demanding activity. Pole dancing, although he prefers to call it sport pole, which he says has less feminine connotations. When guys see this, they think it's a bit out there that a man would do this, but more and more guys are involved. Generally, people can see that it's pretty cool, you need to be a big guy to do it, and girls like men who are big and strong. Pole dancing, or sport pole if you prefer, blends dance moves with acrobatics performed on a vertical bar. Originally perfected by erotic dancers, the physically demanding moves have rapidly found fans in sports clubs and gyms around the world. In Russia, most male adherents are so far keeping quiet about it, but Christian hopes it will soon get the recognition he feels it deserves. It's very tough, a lot tougher than normal gymnastics. That's why I'd like to hope it will eventually become a true sporting discipline. Christian's already performed in France, Spain, Denmark, Germany and Switzerland, where last year he became the world sport pole champion in Zurich. And specialist equipment isn't needed when makeshift poles can be found all over town. Practice sessions like this can draw some curious looks from the Moscow passers-by. This young man is clearly very physically prepared. It's not the sort of thing you normally see. It's a bit unexpected. Suddenly, bam, the guy is on top of a lamppost. At the end of the year, Christian's taking part in a major championship in the US, where his secret ambition is to attract the interest of Arnold Schwarzenegger. With Arnie's name linked to pole dancing, he says, who knows how the image of the sport might take off.